I never heard anything like that before. But according to researchers focusing on throat cancer, many cases are being linked to oral sex. You hear oral, oral sex and you, you don't think about, uh, especially about cancer. Just kind of like, whoa. It's kind, of, it's kind of crazy. A recent report by the Journal of Clinical Oncology finds that as many as 72% of throat tumors in men may be linked to the human papillomavirus, or HPV. Doctors say the virus spreads to men's throats mainly through oral sex. Anything that obviously would, would transport the virus uh, from the genital area into the mouth would be the, would be the cause of exposure of the, uh, of the head and neck to uh, HPV. Medical oncologist Suresh Ratnam says many times the person carrying the HPV virus doesn't show any symptoms, but there are some things to look out for. If someone has a history of having warts or, or, or genital sores, if, if that history is something that one gets to find out about, that is also something to, um, you know, maybe uh, uh, make, make one aware that, that uh, uh, that individual may have been exposed to the virus. That's why Ratnam says you should take steps to keep yourself protected. It opens up your mind and so it just makes you think more and you just got to be really careful what you're doing and I guess be really, really more responsible and stuff.